Welcome to our YouTube channel A to Z Summary. Here is a detailed analysis and summary of the novel Little Women by Louisa May Alcott. Before proceeding further I request you to please subscribe our channel and like the video, also comment your favorite books and novel so that I can provide summary for it, now let's start with the summary. The themes of the novel are The characters of the novel are Little Women by Louisa May Alcott is a classic novel that follows the lives of the four March sisters, Meg, Joe, Beth, and Amy, as they navigate the challenges of growing up in Civil War-era America. The story explores themes of family, love, and the pursuit of individual dreams. The novel is set against the backdrop of the Civil War, and it highlights the sisters' various personalities and aspirations. Meg is the responsible eldest sister, Joe is the independent and ambitious one, Beth is gentle and kind, and Amy is artistic and a bit spoiled. The sisters face financial struggles while their father is away at war, but they find comfort and strength in their close bond. The story begins with the four March sisters lamenting their family's poor financial situation while sitting in their cozy living room. The sisters, Meg, the eldest, Joe, the tomboyish second sister, Beth, the quiet and musical third sister, and Amy, the youngest and artistic sister, discuss their dreams and aspirations. Their father is away at war, and their mother, affectionately known as Marmy, is doing her best to hold the family together. As Christmas approaches, the sisters lament that they won't be able to afford presents. However, they decide to pool their money and buy gifts for their mother. Despite their meager resources, the March family shares a heartwarming and memorable Christmas together. This chapter sets the tone for the novel, emphasizing the importance of love and togetherness over material possessions. The March sisters befriend their wealthy neighbor, Mr. Lawrence, and his grandson, Lori. Lori quickly becomes a close companion, especially to Joe. The girls learn about Lori's tragic family history, and Joe and Lori form a special bond, hinting at a potential romantic subplot later in the story. Marmy leaves to care for their sick father, leaving the four sisters to navigate their lives independently. Each sister faces her own challenges and learns valuable lessons about responsibility and sacrifice. Meg takes on a job as a governess, Joe tries her hand at writing, Beth helps a poor family in need, and Amy struggles with her desire for luxury. The March sisters befriend their new neighbor, Mr. Brooke, who sparks a romantic interest in Meg. The sisters attend a party, where Meg is introduced to high society. However, the experience is bittersweet, highlighting the class differences between the March family and the wealthy elite. Beth, the shy and gentle sister, befriends Mr. Lawrence and finds solace in playing the piano at his house. This chapter explores Beth's character in more depth, emphasizing her kindness and the solace she finds in music. Amy faces humiliation at school when she is punished for bringing limes to share with her classmates. This event prompts her to reflect on her behavior and strive to become a better person. The chapter highlights the theme of personal growth and the importance of humility. Jo struggles with her temper and impulsive nature, leading to conflicts with her sisters. However, she strives to overcome her flaws and become a better person. This chapter delves into Jo's internal struggles and her journey toward self-improvement. Meg is introduced to high society through her friendship with Mr. Brooke, but she becomes disillusioned with the glamorous lifestyle. This chapter explores themes of materialism and the importance of staying true to one's values. Marmy returns home, and the sisters are eager to share their experiences and lessons. Marmy encourages the girls to focus on their virtues and reminds them of the importance of humility and kindness. The chapter reinforces the moral lessons learned by each sister. Joe and Lori continue to spend time together, and Joe grapples with her feelings for him. However, she is determined to prioritize her independence and dreams over romance. This chapter explores the complexities of friendship and romance. The March sisters enjoy a summer vacation at Mr. Lawrence's estate, where they engage in various activities. Joe experiences personal growth, Meg faces romantic challenges, and Beth's health declines. The chapter explores the transient nature of happiness and the inevitability of change. Joe and Lori's friendship deepens, but Joe rejects Lori's romantic advances. Meanwhile, Meg faces the challenges of marriage and family life. The chapter explores the sisters' dreams and the realities they face as they mature. Amy is invited to join Joe in attending a play, but tragedy strikes when they encounter Aunt March. The sisters deal with the consequences of their actions, and Amy reflects on the importance of forgiveness and learning from mistakes. 
The story takes a dramatic turn when the sisters receive a telegram informing them of Mr. March's critical condition. The sisters rally together, demonstrating their love and solidarity in the face of adversity. This part of story explores themes of family bonds and resilience. The narrative shifts to Mr. March's perspective as he writes heartfelt letters to his daughters. The letters provide insights into Mr. March's character and his deep love for his family. The chapter adds emotional depth to the story, emphasizing the enduring connection between father and daughters. Beth's health deteriorates further, and the family rallies around her. Joe, in particular, struggles with the impending loss of her beloved sister. This chapter explores themes of loss, grief, and the strength that comes from family support. The March family faces the harsh reality of Beth's death. The chapter explores the grieving process and the impact of loss on each sister. It highlights the resilience of the human spirit and the power of familial love. Amy grapples with her grief over Beth's death and reflects on her own life. She strives to live a purposeful and meaningful existence, realizing the importance of cherishing every moment. The chapter explores themes of mortality and the search for purpose. Joe confesses her feelings for Lori, but he reveals his love for Amy. Joe grapples with heartbreak and the complexities of love and friendship. This chapter marks a pivotal moment in the story, reshaping the dynamics between the characters. Lori and Joe's friendship undergoes a transformation as they navigate the aftermath of Lori's confession. Joe seeks solace and understanding, while Lori grapples with his own emotions. The chapter explores the complexities of relationships and the importance of forgiveness. In the heartwarming conclusion of Louisa May Alcott's Little Women, each of the March sisters finds their paths to happiness and fulfillment. Joe, the independent and spirited writer, marries Professor Bear, her soulmate and literary mentor. Meg, the nurturing and maternal eldest sister, thrives in her role as a wife and mother. Beth, the gentle and compassionate soul, finds eternal peace in heaven. And Amy, the artistic and ambitious youngest sister, discovers love and companionship with Lori, her childhood friend and confidant. Together, the March sisters celebrate their unbreakable bond and embrace the joys and challenges of life as women in their own right. Who are the four March sisters in Little Women? The March sisters are the four main characters of the novel, Meg, Joe, Beth, and Amy. They are a close-knit group of sisters who live together in Concord, Massachusetts, with their mother, Marmy, while their father is away serving as a chaplain in the Civil War. What are the March sisters' personalities like? Meg is the eldest sister and the most traditional. She is kind, gentle, and maternal. Joe is the second sister and the most tomboyish. She is independent, outspoken, and ambitious. Beth is the third sister and the most gentle and quiet. She is kind, compassionate, and musically talented. Amy is the youngest sister and the most vain. She is artistic, ambitious, and social. What are the March sisters' dreams and aspirations? Meg dreams of getting married and starting a family. Joe dreams of becoming a writer. Beth dreams of having a home of her own. Amy dreams of becoming an artist. What challenges do the March sisters face? The March sisters face a number of challenges throughout the novel, including poverty, illness, and loss. They must also learn to deal with their own personal struggles, such as Meg's desire to conform to societal expectations, Joe's struggle to accept her femininity, Beth's battle with illness, and Amy's vanity and selfishness. How do the March sisters grow and change throughout the novel? The March sisters grow and change in a number of ways throughout the novel. Meg learns to be more independent and assertive. Joel learns to embrace her femininity and accept her love for Lori. Beth learns to be more confident and outgoing. Amy learns to be more humble and compassionate. What is the significance of the setting of the novel? The novel is set in Concord, Massachusetts, during the Civil War era. The setting provides a backdrop for the novel's themes of family, love, and loss. How does Little Women address the issue of women's education and intellectual pursuits? The novel challenges the societal norms by depicting the sisters pursuing intellectual and creative endeavors beyond traditional roles. What lessons about morality and virtue are imparted in the novel? The novel emphasizes the importance of kindness, humility, and moral integrity in the characters' actions and choices. What is the role of Marmy in the story? Marmy is the March sister's mother, providing guidance and wisdom. She serves as a moral compass and source of strength for her daughters. What is the relationship between Joe March and Lori Lawrence? Joe and Lori share a close friendship, 
but Joe rejects Laurie's romantic advances, leading to significant developments in the story. What is the significance of the character of Aunt March in the story? Aunt March is a wealthy relative whose opinions influence the characters. She plays a role in shaping their values and understanding of societal expectations. What is the relationship between Beth and the piano in the novel? Beth finds solace in playing the piano, and her love for music becomes a significant aspect of her character. What is the significance of the Pickwick Club in the story? The Pickwick Club is a club formed by the sisters to support one another in their personal and creative endeavors, symbolizing their unity and shared dreams. What is the ending of novel? The novel Little Women concludes with the four March sisters having grown into adulthood and pursuing their individual paths. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel for more bookish content.